Welcome to East Alabama Today, featuring topics, events, and interesting people from all over East Alabama. Hosted by Carl Brady. Now, let's get right to the show. Here's Carl Brady. Hello, everyone. Welcome in to East Alabama Today. I'm Carl Brady. Thanks for joining us on the program today. We've got a lot to show you today. We are on location at McClellan Assisted Living, which is located uh, at uh, the former Fort McClellan. And we're going to give you all the details, give you kind of a tour, talk about all of the amenities, and just let you know all the things you need to know about McClellan Assisted Living here on East Alabama Today. But first, let me remind you, if you have an idea for the show, we want to hear from you. If you have uh, someone that you know or something going on in your community or in your neighborhood, let us know about it by sending me an email, cbrady at tv24.tv, cbrady at tv24.tv. And uh, let me know what's going on in your community, fairs, festivals, special events, and things like that, because we want to know what's happening in your neck of the woods. And you never know, you may find yourself uh, uh, or your event being featured here on East Alabama Today. I also want to quickly remind you of our website, tv24.tv. If you'd like to watch an archived version of East Alabama Today, any of the shows you've seen, you'd like to watch them again, just go to tv24.tv, go to the On Demand section, and click on East Alabama Today, and there you'll see a, a large archive of shows that you can watch at your convenience. Stay with us. We'll be back in a moment with McClellan Assisted Living. Hello everyone and welcome back into East Alabama today. As I mentioned earlier, we are on location and we're on location at McClellan Assisted Living on the former Fort McClellan in Anniston in Calhoun County. And we're in the, uh, we're in the dining room here at McClellan Assisted Living. And uh, as we go through the show today, we're going to show you a lot of the different amenities that they uh, have here, a lot of the things that uh, they have that are going to be important for you. And we'll let you see what some of the uh, rooms and some of the units look like. Right now, my guest is Amy Lamberty, the executive director. Amy, welcome to the program. Thanks nice for letting to us meet come you. out. Thank you for coming. Well, just give us a quick overview of McClellan Assisted Living. What, what's, what's this place all about? It's about we have great things here. Um, when I came here, I saw, you know, not only an assisted living, but a place where people can come and call their home. We have a lot of things to offer. Our location is great. Um, we have one person say that it kind of reminded them of Gatlingburg, mm -hmm. you know, especially in the fall. All the trees around, it's just beautiful. We are centrally located. Um, you have Jacksonville, the university, right here in Anniston, convenient to everything. And then now that the bypass is here, we're convenient to Oxford. Yeah. We have 45 assisted living apartments. We have 19 independent apartments. We just opened up our fifth floor for independent. So we have five floors and three of them are assisted living, and then the rest is our dining room, the offices, and then independent is also down here on the first floor. Well, let's go ahead and talk about the difference between assisted living and independent living, because mm -hmm. there's, always, there's always a question about sure. which, which one do I need, or which one does, does my grandparent or parent need, assisted right. living or independent living. Talk about the differences there. Assisted living is basically if you have a loved one or you yourself need assistance with medications, um, food, you know, a lot of the older people, they don't like to cook. Mm -hmm. We serve the three full meals. We always have snacks available. And then they also may need assistance with showering, a little bit of dressing. We do housekeeping, laundry. We do the laundry for them. Mm -hmm. So that all comes with the assisted living. Now, yes. The folks who, who choose to go independent living, mm -hmm. what, uh, what's the difference there? Independent, they also get the amenities of the three full meals, the housekeeping and the laundry. It's just we wouldn't have the care staff go and assist with showers, medications, and things like that. Um, 
you know, both assisted and independent living, they are still free to come and go. You know, some of them still drive. Mm -hmm. The ones that don't drive, we have transportation, any kind of doctor's appointments, any errands or activities. They go in the van and go right. to Walmart. Walmart's always special. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, that's that's a, a, a good amenity that's included as part of uh, as, as part of the overall price, and we'll get to to that more mm -hmm. uh, as we go along. But having having that freedom to even if you don't drive, sure. you've got a, a van that's going to various places around yes. town to help them get to mm -hmm. doctor's visits, uh, shopping, uh, going out to eat, things like that. Talk yes. about that service. We do Mondays banking and grocery shopping, and then Angie usually puts in a trip, Dollar General, Walmart, the mall, if they want to go to the mall. So Mondays is basically for that type of transportation. Then Tuesday through Friday, you can schedule doctor's appointments, go to the library, go to the aquatic center next door. Mm -hmm. um, just anywhere in the Calhoun County area that you need to go, we'll take you. Your proximity to the Aniston Aquatic Center has got to be a great selling point for it is. people who want to you know, stay active and get some exercise. Yes, yes. It would take probably about a minute to get there. And I know that they have a pool, they have a gym, but now we also have our own exercise class here. Mm -hmm. And it's Monday through Friday, Angie does it with them. But sure, if they want to go to the Aquatic Center, we can do that. And then, of course, the golf course is here close, too. Right, right. Mm -hmm. So there's plenty of fun things to, to do to keep active. And, yes. And uh, the entertainment areas and common rooms and things like that where people can get together and interact, right? Yes. We also have people that will come in and perform. We've had Kelly Johnson here. Oh, I love Kelly. Yes, Kelly and good yes, yeah. yeah, me too. Um, the Relics, they've been here. Have you heard of them? I know them, yeah. They've been here. They're a big hit, the Alexanders. But then we also have people that just come in, do hymn singing. Mm -hmm. um, we had um, Gaston State for Christmas. Mm -hmm. They were here. They not only sang, but they did a little performing too. Right, right. So that was wonderful. So we not only go out and do activities, we have activities that come to us. That's great. Mm -hmm. Now, let's talk about, since we're in the dining room, you mentioned uh, home-cooked meals. That's all yes. part of the inclusive price. When it you is. you pay your inclusive price, mm -hmm. uh, the, all the things that we're talking about here, uh, there's no hidden things that are going to jump out at you or you no. know, an extra for this, an extra for that every no. time you turn around. Mm -hmm. you're, you guys are all inclusive, and that includes three meals a day. Three full meals a day, breakfast, lunch, and dinner and we put out the weekly menu and if you see something on there that you would you know maybe not particularly like we have alternatives that they can get what are most people looking for when they when they're, when they're looking for assisted living or independent living i know uh, some of the older people that that I know one of the first things they talk about is, I'm so happy not to have a yard to cut anymore. That's <laughs> I don't one have thing. To mow my grass anymore. Yes, yes. Don't have to mow your grass. You don't have to worry about paying your light bill, your gas bill. You don't have to worry about cooking, going out buying a whole bunch of groceries and putting them up. You don't have to worry. Um, you know, if you have a doctor's appointment and it's raining, you know, we've got the van that'll pull right up front for you. Mm -hmm. So everything is just, everything's included. Everything is included. And that's very nice. Now we're gonna, in a few minutes, we're gonna kind of take a tour of uh, one of the model uh, apartments uh, and, and model units and see some of the different uh, amenities and some of the different areas here at McClellan Assisted Living. But before we do that, describe the options. You do have options as far as size uh, it goes for the different units that you that We you have offer. four different plans for assisted living and one one basic plan for independent, mm -hmm. but they're all pretty spacious. Uh, enough room for a full bed, up to a queen size bed, a couple of chairs, your dresser, your chest of drawers, large closet. Um, but yeah, four plans for assisted living. So you can go 
for something small like almost like a studio apartment where yes. everything is in one big room right or you do have an option that's a that's a one bedroom is that correct yes you can do your living room and then your bedroom mm -hmm. and then it would also have two bathrooms what about visitors and security and things like that? That's, uh, that's another thing that people who are living in a community such as this are always concerned with security. We have someone here 24-7. Uh, the doors are locked at a certain time in the evening. If you come in the evening, say we have a resident that will go out for dinner and want to come back 8.30, 9 o'clock, the doors are locked, but then we have the doorbell mm -hmm. and then the staff will come to the door. So everything is, is secure, um, you know, they can come and go. We have to sign in and out mm -hmm. in case it's bedtime and, and <laughs> we go to check on somebody and they're not there. Then right, we, right, you'll we know where they are, yes, know where to yes. find them. And they're really good about telling us, hey, I'm going out with family or I'm going to run to the store. Mm -hmm. yeah. Let's talk a little bit about accessibility. Um, older folks who are your main clients uh, right. who are a lot of times have difficulty getting around and my father personally has um, has Parkinson's mm -hmm. and so he has a difficult time getting around but mm -hmm. so for folks like that what are you, what are your accessibility options and how, how does that work here a lot of them have the walkers some of them have the wheelchairs um, but you know we do assist them we have the pull cords if they need assistance in their apartments, you know, if they need help doing something. More than happy to help them do that. We have an elevator um, that will get them to and from each floor. But the staff is here to assist them in, in any way that they can, any way that they need. Do you have special units that are specifically made for handicapped accessibility? All units. All of the units are, are, are yes. meet all those guidelines? Yes, even okay. in independent, we have the bigger doorways, we have the handrails, the safety rails, and the pull cords. Okay, mm -hmm. well, very good. Is there anything we haven't mentioned before we go and do the tour? Probably. <laughs> Probably is, but yeah. we'll catch up on it. We'll figure yeah. it out before we go. So uh, we're going to take a quick break right here. When we come back, we'll kind of give you a, a little bit of a walking video tour of McClellan Assisted Living. So stay with us. Welcome back into East Alabama today. Again, I'm Carl Brady, and as we said, we're going to kind of give you a tour here at McClellan Independent and Assisted Living, let you see some of the amenities, uh, some of the rooms that are available, give you an idea of what the facility looks like. And I have with me uh, the, now for this segment, Mona Cherry. Mona is the administrative assistant here at uh, McClellan Independent and Assisted Living. So uh, tell us a little bit about this apartment that we are in. This is one of the uh, uh, the, the, the single with, the, I guess you'd call it a studio apartment style. Yes, this is one of our model rooms. And as you can see, it's a very spacious room. We've got room for a, a full bedroom suit. Um, you can sit a dresser here where these chairs and tables are, or you can have this. But uh, it will hold a complete bedroom suit. Mm -hmm. uh, we have <clears throat> um, a large bath. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'd like to show you our bathroom. Uh, it's a very spacious bathroom. We have the shower here, which uh, has a light in it, which is completely unusual, I think. We have a seat that th you can sit or you can stand. We have a stationary shower head, a removable shower head. We have railings and a pull cord here by our shower. By our toilet, we have the railings and a pull cord and uh, railings in the back as well. In our sink area, if you are in a wheelchair or become uh, confined to a wheelchair, a wheelchair will fit right under here. We have plenty of storage space. A large mirror uh, is a very spacious bathroom. Over here we have a closet which is my dream closet. We have a light in the closet. It's very spacious, as you can see. Uh, you can set a chest of drawers in here, a bookcase in here if you'd like. There's plenty of storage for clothes, shoes, and that extra storage that you sometimes bring along. <laughs> um, 
in the room. It has its own heating and cooling system. You can set the temperature on whatever you would like. There's a pull cord by the bed. And we also have uh, interconnect, internet connections behind the bed if you are into the internet. So come back over here with me okay. and, and let's talk about a couple of other things. Okay. We kind of hit on this uh, downstairs in right. the dining room of the all-inclusiveness uh, yes. here at McClellan. Now, that means there, there are no hidden things. There's not going to be some kind of strange thing no. pop up on your bill every time you turn around. You pay one price. That is correct. And that includes all of the amenities and services that, that you offer. Talk about that. We have three meals a day, seven days a week, prepared by a professional chef. We have delicious meals. Uh, we have housekeeping that comes in uh, daily and picks up and straightens up and makes the bed. We have laundry service that comes in twice a week and picks up the dirty laundry. They wash it, dry it, fold it, and bring it back to the residence room. But hang it up if you'd like for us to hang it up. Mm -hmm. uh, we have medication management for those that are in the assisted living. And uh, we have activities of all sorts, ranging from bingo to Yahtzee to dominoes to you name it. We're open for any activities. We have exercise classes daily. You don't have to participate, but we encourage you to. Uh, it's very light exercises. They're all done sitting down. We have, um, and I think uh, Mrs. Lamberti mentioned that we have uh, uh, different groups come in and do activities mm -hmm. as well. So there's always something going on here at McClellan Independent and Assisted Living. Uh, res residents can bring their own furniture, right? Everybody's yes. got their favorite chair, yes. their favorite yeah, absolutely. table. Absolutely. So, so, you, so you don't have to use what's in the room. This is just a model that we're showing that is true. today. But they can, they can accessorize and, and fix it up to make it their own. Absolutely. You bring your own furniture and your own linens. You can hang pictures, whatever pictures you'd like, your grandchildren or children or whoever's picture you want to hang. <laughs> but yes, you can hang whatever you want to on the walls, fix the apartment up the way you like it to make you feel more at home. And we also uh, wanted to mention, we talked about safety and security uh -huh. uh, a little while ago, uh -huh. but let's, let's also talk a little bit about when there's an emergency situation like snowstorms or right. things like that or tornado right. warnings and things like that, you can be assured that your family member who is living here at McClellan is in a safe environment because the, the staff comes in, there's always staff on hand, they're not getting out running around trying to be out in the snow, trying to go find food, there are generators uh, in, in the case the power goes in off, of so you're still going to have food, you're still going to have all of your services, you're going to have power, oh, yes. and you're going to have people here watching out for you and taking care of you. You have a building that's not going anywhere. This mm -hmm. uh, was one of the uh, buildings that was here when Fort McClellan was mm -hmm. in here. And I, it's, bomb proof as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> but there's on really bad days, if there is tornadoes or blizzards or whatever, we have staff. In addition to our PCAs, we have staff that will stay overnight or the weekend or however long is necessary. Uh, you can come and go as you please. You just have to sign in and sign out. We have medication management. Our PCAs, which is personal care assistant, they check on you every two hours. Um, and make sure that everything's okay. Yeah. All right, well, we're gonna take another quick break and come back with uh, an, another area of McClellan Independent and Assisted Living and show you some more of the amenities. We'll be right back. All right, folks, welcome back to East Alabama today. Uh, Carl Brady and Mona Terry here with uh, McClellan Independent and Assisted Living. And we're looking at another apartment. This is a one bedroom apartment. What we showed you earlier was kind of a studio apartment, everything all in, in one room. And this is one of the one bedroom offerings that they have. Uh, Miss Villeen has graciously allowed us to uh, come into her space and uh, to, to see how she's got everything arranged here. And Mona, just kind of tell us about this. This is a nice, large, comfortable you have a little living room here, you've got the bathroom, you've got the bedroom, very nice. Absolutely. This is our largest apartment and as you can see, uh, it this is the living room and uh, 
We also, in the living room area, we have a large closet. I, she has her belongings in here, and I don't want to show her belongings, but <laughs> I respect her for that. But uh, we have a very large walk-in closet with a light. There's plenty of room for all the clothes and shoes and storage you would like to put in there. Mm -hmm. And, uh, of course, this is her bathroom. Uh, again, I'm not going to open this, mm -hmm. but uh, it's a very spacious bathroom with railings and pull cords by the shower. There's also a light in the shower with a, a stool, or you can let it up if you want to stand up. It has a stationary shower head, a removable shower head, railings, and a pull cord by the shower. By the toilet, there's railings and a pull cord. So it's a very spacious bathroom. Mm -hmm. uh, if you want to follow me on in here, uh, we don't want to cause a lot of interruption here, but uh, this is our suite resident, and this is uh, the bedroom, and it's a large, spacious bedroom. You can, as you can see, she has a full-size bedroom suit in here, and again, in the bedroom area, there's the same spacious bath and the same spacious closet that she has in her living room, and um, this is our largest apartment. Mm -hmm. This is so easy to find. Uh, we are located at the old Fort McClellan, which is now, of course, McClellan. Mm -hmm. uh, and there's several uh, ways to get here, but all you have to do is pick up the phone and give us a call at 256-403-6808, and we'll give you directions from wherever you are. Yeah, if you can find the answer to the Aquatic Center, uh, then they're just right next to that. So it's easy to find there. So yeah, easy to find, all-inclusive price. Again, let's mention that. That's a very important uh, point uh, for you guys is yes. that you pay one price and everything uh, that all of the amenities are included. No extra prices, no, no surprises or anything like no that. No hidden cost. Everything comes under one price. That's all of your meals, three meals a day, prepared by a professional chef, and they are very delicious. That's activities, that's uh, laundry services, medication management, housekeeping, exercise classes, trips to and from your doctor appointment, as well as any other appointments that you may have, errand running. Uh, it's all exclusive. One price covers everything. All right, that sounds good. You know, another important thing here at McClellan Independent and Assisted Living is uh, you have a lot of veterans. Yes, We're we are here do. on the former Fort McClellan. Absolutely. So we, we live in an area that is populated with a lot of military veterans. And uh, you guys can provide some assistance and getting them moving in the right direction because the Veterans Association, the VA has the uh, aid in attendance uh, benefits. That's and, and right. So if you haven't taken advantage of your veterans benefits, you guys can lead them in the right direction yes. so that you can get some assistance in, in, in paying for the facility. Yes, um, we have a, several veterans here, a lot of veterans here, and uh, most of them receive aid and assistance from the Veterans Administration. So uh, veterans are welcome as always here yes, in Puebla. Most definitely. Well, welcome back. Our final segment of East Alabama today with the McClellan Independent and Assisted Living Facility, which is located at the former Fort McClellan. Amy, thank you so much for having us here and uh, being here with you today. You've got an amazing facility. I How do so. people get in touch with you if they want to know more information? They can go to our website at McClellanAssistedLiving.com or you can call us at 256-403-6808. Ask for Mona or you can ask for me. Um, we'll give you all kind of information, invite you to come and tour, have lunch with us. And I invite everyone that feels like they have a need for assisted or independent living. And I would also like to invite the professionals uh, in the community to come out and, and tour. Take a look. People in the community need to see yes. what you got going on. Out I agree. There. I Absolutely. agree. Absolutely. Well, Amy, yes. again, thank you very much thank for you letting so us much. come out and visit with you. Folks, thank you as well. And uh, we'll catch you next time on another edition of East Alabama Today.